Hundreds of Washington residents attend an annual gun rights rally in the state's capital with an unexpected guest. One America's Grace Rust has that report. We won't let a hit job from extremists do that to us because like I said in my speech, what we need to preach is tolerance. A pro-Second Amendment rally in Olympia, Washington is hijacked, leaving organizers and attendees in a state of shock and disbelief. According to local reports, comedian Sasha Baron Cohen crashed the March for Our Rights event Saturday, taking to the stage disguised as a country singer. The actor, well known for his leading role in the movie Borat, infiltrated the event as a private donor, equipped with a private security team which prevented his removal from the stage as he sang racist songs, encouraging the crowd to participate. Around 500 people attended the rally put on by the nonprofit group called Washington 3% to show their support for the Second Amendment. The comedian invaded the event by posing as a conservative political action committee, donating money to provide security for the event, along with funding for the entertainment. Founder of Washington 3%, Matt Marshall, said he was completely unaware of Cohen's plans. As one of the organizers, we tried to pull the plug. They had four armed security on the generator, so we couldn't even cut the power. We tried to get on the stage to kick the band off. They had all of the security that was around the stage was then blocking us from getting access to the stage. They wouldn't let us pass the barriers, despite us having our backstage passes that were issued to us. All of the security turned on us. Following his performance, the comedian was escorted by his security to an ambulance, waiting for him at the back of the stage as part of his elaborate scheme. Members of the nonprofit were shocked that someone would go to such lengths to sabotage their efforts. Borat, whoever he is, you know, uh, you know what? The enemy's bullets would have been kinder. Because you know what? I didn't think other Americans could do this to other Americans. Marshall believes Democrat officials plotted and funded the strategic plan to take away from the event's true purpose. However, that has yet to be confirmed. Grace Rust, One America News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube. And call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.